right, good evening and welcome to the Class of 2020 Senior Recognition Awards Ceremony. Uh, my name is Scott Tressiter. I'm the college counselor at Maui High School. And traditionally, this event is held in the gym every spring. We invite all the seniors who are scholarship winners, their friends, their family, and we have a big night of celebration. Obviously, with all the upheaval going on right now in the world, that's not possible. So we're hoping to bring some joy to the evening and recognize all the scholarship winners virtually tonight. Um, I would like to say a special thank you to our arts and communication students. They have worked extremely hard to put this event together for the night. I would also like to thank the presenters who filmed all these at home and sent them in to us. And, you know, that's not always the easiest thing to do. So we really appreciate their help. And the night is broken up into two parts. We have the first part is going to be individual awards given out by the presenters. And then the second half is just all the scholarships that we've been able to collect and are made aware of and recognizing each senior individually for all of their scholarships and the college that they will, they will be attending. So with that, I would like to send it over to our first presenters who are going to recognize the 21 valedictorians at Maui High School who have worked so hard the past four years to earn over a 4.0. And so here is Dr. Baum and Dr. Inouye to begin our presentations. Hello, my name is Colleen Noway and this is my husband, Frank Baum. This is the 17th year we are here sponsoring and presenting the Maui High School Valedictorian Awards to 21 well-deserving individuals. These students were able to achieve a cumulative grade point average of 4.0 or higher and during their entire high school career. These students are remarkable because they were not just studying all the time, but many were members of athletic teams or clubs held class or student body offices, helped in our community, or participated in national competitions, or did all of these activities. These students are a credit to themselves, the faculty and staff of Maui High School, and certainly their families. We hope that they can use this scholarship of $500 toward college or their future career. However, we know at this time of COVID-19, if you need to go ahead and use this money for yourself or your family, please feel free to do so. We hope you will continue to excel in all of your endeavors. At a later date, we will present the valedictorians their checks and give them gifts to represent their post-secondary school plans. The following are the Class of 2020 valedictorians. Olivia Augustine, Jazeri Boy Badua, Megan Begorio, Josiah Castillo, Angelica Joy Daoang, Raymond Del Rey, Kylie Ganoza, Charles Hill, Matthew Hirose, Mark Anthony Mariano, Daniza Faith Nono, Dane Paiba. Jillian Penn, Marichelle Alvina Ramos, Edward John Ratuta, Sarah Sakakahara, Zane Sniffen, La Arni Ann Soriano, Jason Tagala, Ashley Taoka, and Janelle Taraya. Congratulations to the, the class, class of 2020, 2020 valedictorians. valedictorians. You were all leaders as far as during your time of your high school career. And just remember to continue your leadership skills and abilities going into COVID-19 and as far as coming out and into your college or future career endeavors. Congratulations. Aloha, my name is Rosie Iwohi and I am happy to be presenting a $500 gift of Aloha Scholarship to a member of Maui High's Class of 2020. This is one of two gifts being awarded this year. In its eighth year, this scholarship is presented in honor and memory of my Hanai grandparents, the late Claro Sr. and Maxima Kapili of Kahului, who truly resemble the Aloha spirit in our community throughout their lives. 
This scholarship is resourced by my brother Adam Suyat and his wife Kwe of Washington State, as well as supporters of the scholarship Donna and John Boyce of California. The main factor in the selection process of this award is the applicant's reflective response to the prompt, who or what has made an impact in your life and helped shape who you are today. The response may be submitted in just about any form, an essay, poem, song, video, but in the case of tonight's recipient, it came in the form of a painting. The painting represents the influence of a particular teacher. A small piece of the written explanation reads, in my painting, I draw the world with her and I sitting on the top of it, indicating how her words have made me feel powerful or as people like to say, on top of the world. The inspiration behind this piece is Maui High's AP English teacher, Mrs. Tracy Rosario, and the art and reflection in the work is the work of her student 2020 Gift of Aloha Scholarship recipient, Daniza Faith Nono. On behalf of Adam and Kwe, Donna and John, the Kapili and Suyat Ohana, congratulations to you, Daniza. We wish you the very best in your future. Hi, my name is Joel Rand. I'm the scholarship chair for the Rotary Club of Kahului. I want to uh, congratulate each and every Maui High senior for an outstanding career and congratulations on the class of 2020 for making it this far. I know these have been challenging times and it's been difficult finish to the year, but this shouldn't diminish your accomplishments in the years that you've put in to get here. So I want to congratulate you, your families, and the educators that have brought you to this place. Uh, you all deserve a great round of thanks. Now uh, onto our scholarship presentations. We have six different scholarships. Um, the first of which is the Hawaii Rotary Youth Foundation Scholarship. That is a $5,000 scholarship. And that will be going to Matthew Hirose, uh, to the college and university of his choice. The other four scholarships are the Michael H. Lyons II scholarships. Those scholarships are for different students in the amount of $2,000, and those go to the following students. Raymond Delray, Dane Paiba, Marissa Filizar, Deniza Nono, and those four will be receiving uh, the Michael H. Lyons II scholarship. The last scholarship we have uh, from our club is the Garner Hall Ivy Junior Scholarship, and that is in the amount of $1,500, and that reward will go to Sarah Sakakihara. Again, thank you all for arranging to at least get a little bit of celebration in for your accomplishments. These are all well-deserved and outstanding students in class. Again, congratulations, the class of 2020. Thank you. I'm Aaron Kondo. I'm a social studies teacher at Maui High School, and I'm presenting the Filipino Women's League Scholarship for $2,000 to Mark Mariano. Mark was a student in my economics and geography classes. Uh, he worked really hard this year. Um, I appreciated his efforts, and uh, he was a pleasure to have in class. Uh, he intends to stay in Hawaii and uh, use this money to defray the cost of his tuition and uh, the Filipino Women's League gives a scholarship annually to support Maui seniors uh, in their quest for a college education. Hi, I'm Jerry Eiding from the Maui Scottish Rite of Freemasonry. The Scottish Rite is a branch of Freemasonry primarily concerned with knowledge and enlightenment, a quest for light. And as such, we're excited to be able to provide scholarships to the students of Maui County Public Schools. We've been doing so for the past 30 years and have given away over $250,000. This year, we're giving away $10,000 in 10 $1,000 increments and are very pleased to be offering three Maui High students this award. The first goes to
Dane K. Heba. The second goes to Matthew Y. Hyros. And the third goes to David Hawk Alexander. On behalf of the Maui Scottish Rite, I wish you the best of luck in life. Aloha. Hello, my name is Brian Moto, Maui High School class of 1977. I am representing today Maui Sons and Daughters of the Nisei Veterans, Maui HAA Veterans Scholarship Program. Each year, this program awards 10 $1,000 scholarships to outstanding graduates of Maui's high schools. The scholarship program was established by veterans of Japanese ancestry who, having served on the battlefields of Europe, Asia, and the Pacific, returned to Maui to support their communities and youth education. Today, I'm very pleased to announce two winners of Maui High School's Class of 2020. They are Brianna Marie Taguchi and Sarah Sakakihara. Congratulations, Brianna Marie and Sarah. Hello everybody, my name is Gina Conche. I'm a Spanish teacher at Maui High School. I am also serving right now on the Multilingualism Task Force for the Hawaii Department of Education. The Hawaii State Board of Education established a seal of biliteracy to be awarded upon graduation to students who demonstrate a high proficiency in either the state's two official languages, English or Hawaiian, and one additional language. This year is the second year that Maui High is presenting this award. I'm honored today to present 12 students with the Seal of Biliteracy Award. Angelica Acaso for proficiency in English and Tagalog. Cecile May Arcala for proficiency in English and Tagalog. Genesis Balan for proficiency in English and Ilocano. Agnes Bernados for proficiency in English and Tagalog. Robina Jane Kavanting for proficiency in English and Tagalog. Ralph Kakayurin for proficiency in English and Tagalog. Charles Hill for proficiency in English and Spanish. Yesenia Pena for proficiency in English and Spanish. Nicole Rabanal for proficiency in English and Tagalog. Lucia Roflo Rumbao for proficiency in English and Tagalog. Brianna Sachs for proficiency in English and Spanish. And Aubrey Santiago for proficiency in English and Spanish. Congratulations to all of you. You really deserve it. Hi, I'm Kerry Wasano, Band Director at Maui High School. The James Kiroguchi Band Scholarship is sponsored by our Band Booster Club and awards up to five $500 scholarships yearly to band seniors who displayed outstanding musical achievement, attitude, participation, and leadership during their time with us. On behalf of the Maui High Band Booster Club, I am honored to present the 2020 James Kiroguchi Band Scholarship to Jobel Daludado, Kenny Hamada, Shania Lee, Mark Anthony Mariano, and Sarah Sakakihara. Congratulations and best of luck in the future. Hi, my name is Christine Lemma and I am this year's coordinator of the Maui High School AVID program, which stands for Advancement via Individual Determination. AVID is a program that helps students attain their goal of attending college by developing students' organizational skills, note-taking ability, applications for college and scholarships, tutorial groups, and more. For the past several years, the Maui High School AVID program has received extremely generous support from the Charles and Mitch Ota Foundation, a Maui-based Hawaii nonprofit. 
Just this year, the OTA Foundation gifted our school with 33 Google Chromebooks and accessories for use by students in the AVID program. In years past, the OTA Foundation has paid for overnight trips to Oahu for students to, to tour various colleges and attend a college fair, as well as an AVID senior banquet and various other generous gifts such as paying for student planners and much more. This year, the Charles and Mitch Ota Foundation has truly outdone themselves by offering our Maui High AVID seniors a $2,500 grant for each one of them who attends college in the fall. This is truly a dream come true for many of our students some of whom will be the first person in their family to attend college. So it is with great pleasure that I present this OTA Foundation grant, grant of $2,500 to each one of the eligible seniors of Maui High School's AVID program. Congratulations, seniors. Hello, I'm Michelle Sarah, a math teacher at Maui High School. I'll be presenting the Foodland Scholarships today. Foodland is a tremendous supporter of schools statewide and has the annual Shop for Higher Education competition that runs late February through March. Proceeds from this competition go to support scholarship programs across the state and to help fund project grad at numerous schools. Thanks to our Maui High community for shopping at Foodland and designating Maui High during the competition. Because of support from Maui High's friends and family, Maui High has been awarded the maximum of five $2,000 scholarships for the class of 2020. The recipients this year are Dane Paiba, Christine Alonzo, Brianna Taguchi, Kylie Kinoza and Sarah Sakakihara. So congratulations to all of you and congratulations to our class of 2020. Best wishes. Aloha, my name is Greg Peros and I'm honored to kick off the presentation for the Maui High School Foundation 2020 scholarships. There will be a series of presenters helping me in announcing the foundation winners, but first I'd like to share a little more with you about a nonprofit organization. The Maui High School Foundation is dedicated to promoting and fostering the development of Maui High School. First established in 1995, the foundation's community of supporters has grown tremendously throughout the years, along with its efforts and impact to enhance the overall experience at the school. For the Maui High School Hall of Honor, which serves to celebrate and uphold the Sabre legacy, to our grants program, which offers financial support for student groups and programs, the Maui High School Foundation works diligently in many ways to facilitate the help of individuals, businesses, and community partners alike in supporting this school, its faculty, and its students. Our scholarship program chaired by Mr. Scott Tressler is no exception. I'm excited to announce that this year the Maui High School Foundation will award a total of $18,000 in scholarships to members of the class of 2020. We want to thank everyone who has donated to our foundation or supported our annual Hall of Honor fundraiser, which helps to fund these scholarships. In addition, we want to especially thank the following for sponsoring a foundation scholarship this year. Joy Yamoka for Health Services, Joyce Diaz for Future Educators, Ione and Gavin Isobe of a and Refrigeration for Industrial and Engineering Technology, Bruce Anderson for Arts and Communication, Terence, Diane Sherman, and Ethel Yogi, and Dennis and Gracie Chi for sponsoring the Aaron Joey Yogi Memorial Scholarship. Mahalo for your sponsorships. And now, without further ado, I am pleased to announce the recipients of the Maui High School Foundation General Scholarship $1,000 Award. We have three recipients this year. Raymond Brex Del Rey. Raymond is a National Honor Society treasurer completed his Eagle Scout project this year, selected as a scholar athlete for Maui High, and was a varsity quarterback. Jillian Ped. Jillian made significant contributions to the performing arts at Maui High. 
the choir president, active in both the chamber choir and show choir. In the arts and communication pathway, completed graphic jobs for community members and plays on the Maui High golf team. Ashley Taoka. Ashley is the captain of both the Maui High soccer team and surf team. She's a member of the Maui High Avia program for the past four years and does countless community contributions through her work in 4-H Club of Maui for the past eight years. All three recipients are also valedictorians. Congratulations to each of you and best wishes from the Maui High School Foundation. The Board of Directors of the Maui High School Foundation extend our congratulations to the class of 2020 and wish you the very best for your new ventures and all that life has in store for you. If you can dream it, you can do it. Good luck as you move on to your next chapter in life. Aloha. Aloha Maui High School, my name is Leilani Abafo and I'm currently a teacher in the Arts and Communications Pathway. I'm here this evening to announce the winner of this year's Maui High School Foundation CTE ACOM Scholarship. And the recipient of this scholarship goes to Josiah Castillo. Josiah has been involved in our ACOM Pathway for four years. He's a completer in both our broadcast media and graphic design pathways. He also recently served as the president of our video club. He's won numerous awards on the local, national, and global level. Despite many of his challenges that he faced growing up, he's never made an excuse, and he always continuously wanted to learn more. We're proud to say that Josiah will be attending New York University this fall to continue his love of storytelling and study film. Congratulations, Josiah, on a job well done, and on behalf of the entire ACOM Ohana, we wish you the best of luck. Aloha, my name is Rondi Arquero, and I teach graphics and education at Maui High School. We would like to thank our former principal, Mr. Bruce Anderson, for sponsoring the second ACOM scholarship. It is my pleasure to announce the winner, Kathleen Sajabo. Kathleen has always shown great talent and commitment to Maui High School. She has designed many things for Maui High, including our faculty shirt and the Maui High School Foundation newsletters. Thank you, Kathy, for all of your hard work. Congratulations and best wishes. Aloha, I'm Alan Kennedy, Arts and Communication Entrepreneurship Teacher at Maui High School. Today I'd like to take time to congratulate Megan Magorio in um, winning the CTE Business Foundation Scholarship. I think Megan really deserves this award. Um, the four years that I've had her, uh, her sophomore year and senior year, she stepped up and ran the Valentine's Day sale at Maui High School, executing over 150 deliveries across campus in a period of uh, eight hours. On top of that, Megan has really shown me her ability to adapt and um, face any challenge by learning skills um, on a whim uh, when necessary. Uh, her graphic capabilities really improved this past year and I'm really proud of her. Um, and I really think she, she deserves to be the winner of the CTE Business Foundation Scholarship. Congratulations, Megan. Hello everyone, may the fourth be with you. My name is Keith Imara. I am a science and technology teacher here at Maui High School. I have the privilege of announcing the Maui High School STEM CTE Foundation Scholarship Award for this year. Thank you to the Maui High School, to the Maui High Foundation for supporting all of our students. I'd like to begin with a short quote from President Kennedy's speech about Ma America's race to the moon. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. Because that challenge is one that we are willing to accept. I believe this quote exemplifies our recipient. The deserving winner of this award is someone who I knew was academically sound and would end up near the top of his class. 
Over the years, I have also discovered a student who would find ways to apply his knowledge and skill in STEM areas, but also challenge himself with his course and project choices. He truly learned to embrace the hard and difficult and use them as a measuring tool of his motivation and abilities. From club president, National Honor Society, Cyber Patriot, Congressional App Challenges, tennis, esports, and more, he proved to us and himself his persistence to succeed. I'm honored to present the STEM CTE Foundation Scholarship Award to Dane Paiba. Hello, I'm Mr. Baez, building and construction teacher at Maui High School. It gives me great pleasure in announcing the recipient of the IET section of the CTE scholarship. This scholarship goes out to Mark Mariano. I've had the privilege of teaching Mark for the past four years. I have seen Mark mature in front of me. Mark is a great example of what a well-rounded student should be. He is academically strong, he participates in extracurricular activities, and he is able to hold a part-time job while going to school. I have no doubt Mark will go out into the world and leave his legacy for others to follow. Congratulations, Mark. Hi, I'm Gavin Isobe, and I'm the owner of ANI Refrigeration Sales and Service Inc. along with my mother, Ioni Isobe. Last year marked the 10th year of my father's passing. In his honor, and also to celebrate the fact that we have continued the business that he started 43 years ago, we decided to establish a scholarship at our family's alma mater, Maui High School. Both my parents graduated from the H. Poco campus, and my sister and I graduated from the Kahului campus. The purpose of our scholarship is to make the dream of college a reality for local students who want to stay on Maui and want to improve our community. That is, to continue to make Maui no kahoi. I'm happy to announce this year's recipient, Zane Sniffin. Congratulations and best wishes. Congratulations. Aloha Maui Hai, good to be back. Hope everyone is staying safe. My name is Aaron Joyo and I was a former CTE health teacher at Maui High School. I am so honored to present a few scholarships to you seniors. First is a Maui High School Foundation CTE health scholarship for $1,000. This recipient is truly a remarkable young woman that I've seen grow into a great student, leader, and future health professional. Truly one of a kind never complained, always turned in quality work, and always striving to make her community and her peers better. Congratulations, Bromalyn Tamankura. The next two scholarships are awarded by Joy Yamaoka in the memory of Don, Alice, and Carl Yamaoka. Each scholarship is $500. These scholarships are to support students in health services who plan to work on Maui post-graduation. First, Aubrey Santiago. Congratulations, Aubrey. Hard work truly pays off. I've seen Aubrey work so hard over the years from schoolwork in HOSA, and it just all seemed to pay off your senior year. So congratulations, proud of you, and she can save your life, CPR and first aid. Next, Serena Yuen. I have not had the privilege of getting to know Serena personally, but I've heard only great things from your teachers and counselors. Congratulations, Serena, and keep up the great work. I'm so proud of all of you. I can't wait to see the great things you do in the future and the legacy you create. Remember, pressure makes diamonds, so keep persevering. Mahalo, stay safe, Maui. Mr. Steele, and I was a culinary teacher for the PHS department, and I wanted to announce the scholarship winner uh, for this year, which is Sebastian Montero Pumada. Uh, Sebastian was a great leader 
uh, in the culinary department, helped us on a number of projects, uh, including large luncheons that we did for teachers and for the College for Career Day. Uh, so Sebastian has been uh, a high academic 3.5 GPA most of his uh, Maui High career. It started out even as a freshman taking uh, AP prep classes. So congratulations, Sebastian, and we wish you the best on your future endeavors. Aloha everyone. I hope you and your families are well and safe. My name is Danny De Jesus, and although I'm currently not teaching at Maui High, my heart is with you all as I consider myself a lifelong saber. From 2009 to 2019, I had the honor of being involved in a program that I truly believe helped hundreds of Maui High students realize their post-secondary potential, and that program is AVID. To help with these post-secondary opportunities, the Maui High Foundation has graciously awarded a scholarship to an AVID senior who has demonstrated not only commitment to his or her academic pathway, but the development of the skills needed to be successful in college. It is with the greatest pleasure that I present the Maui High Foundation AVID Scholarship to Denisa Nono. I met Denisa when she was in eighth grade, full of life and energy and ambition. And after all these years and many, many challenges, Denisa is still full of life and energy and ambition. Her academic record is impeccable. Her leadership skills are off the chart. But most importantly, she has a heart of gold. Congratulations, Denisa. I know you're going to continue to do wonderful things in this world. You are an inspiration to us all. Good evening, my name is Tayo Gaswar and I'll be presenting the Bob Diaz Future Teacher Scholarship on behalf of my Auntie Joyce Diaz and late Uncle Bob. The Bob B. Diaz Future Teacher Scholarship was created in honor of my late uncle who was an educator for 32 years in California. He was not only a teacher but a mentor, coach, and friend to countless students during the course of his career. Former students remember his love of life, good-natured personality, and dedication to them. Born and raised in Haiku, he had fond memories of growing up on Maui. He was a 1952 graduate of the old Maui High School and participated in many activities while there. Creating this scholarship was a way to honor his memory and also a way to give back to the school, community, and family he loved so dearly. Instead of just two, two scholarships, Mayandi has decided that there will be, get, uh, there will be three $1,000 scholarships given in its inaugural year. The recipients are Christine Alonzo, Kaylin Garaganza, and Matthew Hirose. All of the applicants reviewed are smart, accomplished, and talented with bright futures ahead of them and embody Bob's dedication, spirit, and enthusiasm. Best wishes to each of you as you follow your dreams. Congratulations. Hello everyone, my name is Diane Yogi and I'm Erin Joey Yogi's mom. On behalf of the Yogi and Ishii families, we are honored to be able to offer three of the Erin Joey Yogi Memorial Scholarships to the class of 2020, which would have been the year that Erin graduated. This scholarship is offered in memory of 16-year-old Erin Joey Yogi, who was a junior at Maui High School. On September 11, 2018, her life was cut tragically short in an automobile accident. Erin leaves behind a legacy of promoting kindness and putting others' needs before her own. Erin is remembered for being humble, inclusive, and bringing out the best in others. She had a way with words that made people feel accepted and loved, and she had a smile that was contagious. Her dream was to become a psychologist and to spend her life helping people. 
Erin's passion for helping others will be memorialized to the recipients of these scholarships. Our family is proud to present Kiana Maganoy and Aubrey Santiago with a $1,000 scholarship each and Bryce Sarah with a $500 scholarship. You are all outstanding students and through your own personal experiences have made such a positive impact on people's lives. We truly believe that you will continue to do so in your future careers. Thank you to everyone that applied for the scholarship. You all share Erin's passion and have such bright futures ahead of you. We are all so very proud of all of you. Thank you to Maui High School Foundation for allowing us to keep Erin's memory alive through these scholarships. Thank you. All right, congratulations to all the scholarship winners. Um, I think this class is very special. They worked very hard at turning in scholarships even after all the upheaval took place. So just congratulations to all of them for continuing to work hard and persevere and get their scholarship applications completed. I would also like to give a thank you to a few organizations. One is uh, Tante's for a tennis scholarship that they sponsor. Uh, Star Advertiser for a scholarship they sponsor for a Maui High student, and then the Mamoro and Aiko Takatani Foundation. They've also sponsored scholarships for Maui High students every year. We just were not able to <coughs> film those segments at this point in time. And then also a special thank you to the Maui Filipino Chamber of Commerce Foundation. They sponsor a minimum of 10 $1,000 scholarships every year for Maui students. Uh, last year I think they sponsored 16 scholarships and their fundraiser was postponed because of COVID and it's rescheduled for July. It's a big golf tournament and they are hopeful to give out um, over 10 scholarships this year, which I would think there'll be some Maui High recipients. So thank you to them for their continued support of high school students. Um, and before we transition to the second phase of the program, I want to give a special recognition and thank you to Don Suenaga. She's the college counseling clerk and without her, all the services that we provide to these students, it just wouldn't be possible. She works so hard every day to assist your, your students in getting applications complete, FAFSA, transcripts, uh, scheduling visits for the colleges on campus. So just a huge mahalo to Dawn for all the support that she gives these students. We, we're gonna transition to the second phase where we're gonna recognize each scholarship winner individually, regardless of whether they were recognized in the first portion of the program. And these are just all the scholarships that we were able to gather. Uh, it wasn't as easy this year as before, so there are other winners, but these are the ones that we, we know about, and really big congratulations to them for all the scholarships they've earned. Shandy Marie Agpoon, parents Sanders Agpoon and Cindy Figueroa from Kahului, should be attending Grand Canyon University to study nursing. David Alexander, Parents Amber and Marty Alexander from Kihei. He will be attending University of Hawaii, Maui College to study electronic and computer engineering technology. Natasha Alexander. Parents Ronald Alexander and Sharice Tom from Kahului. She'll be attending Arizona State University to study architectural studies. Christine Alonzo. Parents Pedro and Luz Alonzo from Kahului. She will be attending University of Hawaii at Manoa to study education. Allison Aoki, parent Analiza Aoki from Kahului. She'll be attending Portland State University to study computer science. Olivia Augustine, parents Sarah Augustine and Jude Augustine from Kihei. She will be attending Villanova University to study biology. Jizari Boybadua. Parents Larry and Janice Padua from Wailuku. He'll be attending Grand Canyon University to study digital film. Megan Bagario. Parents June and Dina Bagario from Kihei. She will be attending University of Hawaii Maui College to study business. Genesis J. He Balaan. Parents Benjamin and Jeremy Lynn Balasteros from Kahului. He'll be attending University of Hawaii, Maui College to study nursing. Janae Bulusan. Parents Ronaldo and Conception Bulusan from Kahului. 
She will be attending Windward Community College to study associate in science in veterinary technology. Josiah Costello, parent Nikki Richardson from Kahului, who'll be attending New York University to study film. Isaiah Chi, parents Joe and Karen Chi from Kihei. He will be attending Grand Canyon University to study communications. Jabelle Daludado, parents Joffrey Daludado and Amabel Gay Daludado from Kahului. She'll be attending Seattle University to study biochemistry. Angelica Daoeng. Parents Carlo and Lailani Daoeng from Wailuku. She will be attending Evergreen State College to study environmental studies. Brooks Daoeng. Parents Christina and Enrico Daoeng from Kihei. He'll be attending Southern Utah University to study biology slash pre-medicine. Elijah Evangelista. Parents Terry and Ernesto Evangelista from Kahului. He will be attending Dixie State College to study exercise science. Marissa Villazar, parents Mark and Crisanta Villazar from Mailuku. She'll be attending Grand Canyon University to study education. Kaylin Garaganza, parents Nathan Garaganza and Makana Brito from Kahului. She will be attending University of Hawaii, Maui College to study education. Kylie Ginoza, parents Kyle and Kim Ginoza from Mailuku. She'll be attending University of Utah to study biology or civil engineering. Nicole Ann Guzman, parents Noel and Alma Guzman from Kahului. She will be attending Grand Canyon University to study nursing. Kenny Hamada, parents Michael Hamada and Nancy Tomizawa from Mailuku. She'll be attending University of Hawaii at Manoa to study engineering. Coben Harris, parents Nicole and Justin Rowland, Chad Harris from Kihei. He will be attending Illinois Valley Community College to study marketing. Charles Hills, parents Carrick and Rebecca Hill from Kihei. He'll be attending Brigham Young University to study mechanical engineering. Matthew Hirose, parents Eric Hirose and Kylie Bonificio from Kihei. He will be attending University of Portland to study secondary education. Chris Oleano, parents Lori Andamo and Sharon Damo from Mailuku. She'll be attending the Army as a Signal Support System Specialist. Shania Lee, parents Zena Perry and Kayani Lee from Makawao. She will be attending University of Hawaii at Manoa to study music theory and composition. Alex Makarek. Parents Nora and Jenner Makarek from Mailuku. He will be attending University of Hawaii at Manoa to study electrical engineering. Kiana Maganoe. Parents Leo and Nicole Maganoe from Mailuku. She will be attending Upper Iowa University to study accounting. Walter Lese Makoni. Parents Anna Malafu Eliasa and Tokava Eliasa from Kihei. She'll be attending University of Michigan Dearborn to study aerospace engineering. Mark Anthony Mariano, parents Henry and Maritas Mariano from Kahului. He will be attending University of Hawaii at Manoa to study civil engineering. Rylan Matsuura, parents Harry and Christy Matsuura from Makawao. He will be attending Universal Technical Institute to study automotive. Kyla Montero Quimado, parents Antonio and Carmelita Quimado from Kahului. She will be attending Arizona State University to study economics. Sebastian Montero Quimado, parents Antonio Quimado Jr. and Carmelita Quimado from Kahului. He'll be attending California Polytechnic State University, San Luis Obispo to study food science. Denisa Faith Nono, parents Danilio and Liza Nono, from Kahului. She will be attending Pacific University to study psychology. Dean Paiba, parents Shane and Denise Paiba from Mailuku. He will be attending University of California, Los Angeles to study computer science and engineering. Jillian Ped, parents Richard and Isabelita Ped from Mailuku. She will be attending San Diego State University to study advertising. Caitlin Pimentel, 
Parents Kelly Rich and Neil Pimentel from Kihei. She'll be attending Embry-Riddle Aeronautical University to study aeronautical science. Shania Panero. Parent Cherise Panero from Kahului. She will be attending Grand Canyon University to study psychology. Marichelle Elvena Ramos. Parents Marianita Ramos and Willie Ramos from Kahului. She'll be attending University of Hawaii Maui College to study nursing. Brianna Sachs. Parents Jeanette and Tyson Sachs from Kahului. She will be attending University of Hawaii Maui College to study creative media with an emphasis in computer graphics. Sarah Sakakihara. Parents Linda Monden and Scott Sakakihara from Mailuku. She'll be attending California Polytechnic State University, San Luis Obispo to study civil engineering. Aubrey Santiago. Parents Alexander and Myra Santiago from Mailuku. She will be attending University of Hawaii at Manoa to study pre-medical technology. Bryce Sarah. Parents Trent and Michelle Sarah from Kahului. He'll be attending the University of Hawaii at Manoa to study pharmacy. Kathleen Sajablo. Parents Romeo and Leonila Sajablo from Kihei. She will be attending University of Hawaii Maui College to study creative media. Zane Sniffen. Parent Myrna Sniffen from Kahului. He'll be attending University of Hawaii Maui College to study applied business and information technology. Larne and Soriano. Parents Oscar Arnell and Zenaida Soriano from Kahului. She will be attending University of Hawaii Maui College to study hospitality and tourism. Romelain Joy Tabankura. Parents Romeo and Rosalind Tabankura from Kahului. She'll be attending University of Hawaii Maui College to study nursing. Jason Tagala. Parents Lourdes and Ellie Tagala from Kahului. He will be attending University of Portland to study civil engineering. Brianna Marie Taguchi. Parents Lori Tomita and Eric Taguchi from Kahului. She'll be attending Oregon State University to study marketing. Ashley Taoka. Parents Truman and Mandy Taoka from Kihei. She will be attending University of Hawaii at Manoa to study business. Jana E.J. Torejas. Parents John and Elena Torejas from Kahului. He'll be attending University of California, Irvine to study computer science. Leilani Angel Vesquiz. Parents Catherine and Ferdinand Vesquiz from Kahului. She will be attending University of Hawaii, Maui College to study creative media. Serena Yuen. Parents Charmaine and Dawson Yuen from Mailuku. She'll be attending St. Martin's University to study nursing. So once again, just another congratulations to the Class of 2020 scholarship winners. Um, I just want to say this group is a very special group. They, like I say, have really persevered. Um, they're one of the nicest group of kids you will ever meet with just such good hearts. And they're so caring and giving to our community and to their classmates. And I'm just really proud of them and the way that they have persevered and dealt with real hardship during this time you know, and everything they've gone with losing this last quarter of their school year. And they managed to maintain a pretty positive attitude about it. So just a big shout out to all the seniors. I think it's very impressive the way you guys have conducted yourself. I'd also like to thank all the parents for supporting your kids through their entire education and culminating in, you know, the scholarships that we just saw right here. It's like I say, a very impressive bunch of kids. And another thank you to all the Maui High teachers and staff for all the support they give kids throughout the year related to the scholarship process. So mahalo to them. And with that, we're going to send it to Principal Yap for a final closing message. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. And let me make sure I take this off in the time of COVID-19 that uh, we're all wearing our masks. I want to say again, good evening, everyone. Thank you for taking the time. Special thank you to all of our seniors, all of our guests our presenters, and everyone who shared uh, in tonight's event. And uh, great success is only hoped and wished for for our seniors that will be receiving this scholarship money. Uh, put it to good use, and hopefully uh, this will never happen again. COVID will never happen again, and you will be the problem solvers of the future. So um, none of the seniors after your class will have to do this again. So 
Again, I want to thank all of you and congrats, congratulate all of our uh, seniors for their hard work, the time, the diligence, and this um, unsettling times having to do, having to deal with uh, uh, what was thrown at you. Um, you guys have been a very resilient class, and you guys have done a great job. So thank you for all your hard work. I want to wish everyone well. Stay safe. Take care. Mahalo.